Your branded, your branded goods, you know, like you've got, you've got a branded good there, haven't you? No, this is, this is just... No, this. Oh, right, this uh, is, is the it, camera, yeah. Yes, but it, it's, yeah. it's got the name on it. Mm -hmm. And I think youngsters go for, for names. Yeah. Because they want that name. Mm -hmm. it, it, it's like, almost like a status thing. Um, and I think you can buy exactly the, a similar thing that looks the same. Um, without the branded name on. Mm -hmm. um. do, 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 you, do you mind if you film this? Or you, I do you, mind if you film it. So you don't want to? Uh, that's uh, fine. No. What about audio, if we just recorded the conversation? Yeah. Completely up to you, if not. Um, I do feel quite embarrassed. I can, I can talk to you on a one-to-one -one basis. Yeah. Um, but I, I do feel quite... quite yeah, no, that, that's absolutely fine. So there's no um, pressure at all. The only reason, I, the only reason I'll say, say, that, say why is um, I'm on tablets at the moment. I, I'm had a cancer removed and my brain is not quite the same as it. It's not as sharp as it normally is. Mm -hmm. And I suddenly, my brain <laughs> suddenly go. And if you're put under pressure, that can make you worse. Yeah, and, okay, no, honestly. And I'd feel, I would feel an absolute idiot then. Well, no, I mean, absolutely no pressure to us. That's fine. He's deaf. Aren't you, darling? You're deaf. Yes. Oh, really? Yes. He went deaf about three years ago. It was when it was hot. Um, and it was at about five o'clock in the evening. No. He'd been oh, out really? for a walk. No, don't do that. He'd been out for a no. walk during the day. And he, d he had like a fit, an epileptic fit. Then it it was only seconds, but it seemed like ages. He didn't know where he was. Um, and then, then we found out he was deaf. Because I do competition obedience with them. But now I can't work him, not, not, not in a competition, because he um, preempts all my movements. If I move a finger, he thinks, ah, oh, right, I know what mum wants. Oh, okay, and yeah. of course, it's not. Yeah. So yeah. I have to be you know, very, very precise with him. But they they judge him quite harshly, and I think it's a shame because he loves to work. Um, just because he's deaf, I don't think he should be, um, you know, penalised for that. So, oh, wow. ta -ta -ta -ta. What, what breeds are they? These two are Welsh sheepdogs, and they're like the old Welsh sheepdog. They've got no pedigree other than the fact that the lady um, who bred them. She can trace all the sheep dogs that they've had on their, their farms right back to the drovers dogs. Um, and they've, the, the dogs have sort of gone through all the different families. Um, but the kennel club won't, won't, won't recognize them. Oh, really? No, they just class them as a working sheep dog, but they're not because the Welsh sheep dog, they say the character is completely and utterly different. Whereas he, well, he's supposed to be a border, but I don't think he is a border collie. Uh, I think he's the same as these. I think he's another Welsh one. He could, they all came off Welsh working farms, but he's got double hip dysplasia. Oh, wow. How, how old are they? Um, 10, 9, 6. Uh, I've got a Labradoodle. Oh. He's, he's going to be 11 in June. Oh, bless. So, so you must... No, that wouldn't have been the first one of the first ones. It, He's fourth generation Labradoodle. He's the fourth generation. Yeah. Does he molt? He molts for England. Yeah. <laughs> but we we got him because we thought Labradoodles don't molt. Weren't meant to molt. No. But, oh wow, he does. Yes, yeah. He does. Well, the thing the thing is, but that when they first, Tam, Tamba, don't do that. Kika doesn't like it. Um, when they first started to breed, breed them, some of them didn't molt. So then they were selling them as a non-molting dog. And now they find that all, all, all the dogs that they're crossing, um, with a lab, you know, like a Labradoodle or um, a Cockapoo, or, um, they still molt. Mm. Not all of them, but quite a lot of them still do molt. Uh, yeah, I think with my, my the Saxon he's called, he's, he's more Labrador than Poodle, I think that's, why? Because the other the other ones in his litter were they had thick, wiry hair. Right. But he's more like well, Labrador, kind of thin. And he, sh he, oh, he just sheds hair rather than bag load. It's crazy. Yeah. Well, they. I mean, these are le these are losing their coat at the moment. Mm. Um, 
and he is as well. He like little lumps look. <laughs> but normally, yeah, lovely, eh? normally I would strip strip them out. Tammy, don't do that, darling. <laughs> yes, I know you don't like that on your face. But come on, we better walk right, on. Right, no, thank you for that. That's, um, well, good nice luck. To meet you. Yeah, no, thank you. You have to ask the younger people. Well, I, I, I'm going to. I'm trying to get a mixture of. Oh right. Of different kind of because whether there's obviously fashion is different with generations and religion and. Yes, yeah, yeah, yeah. But I mean, I don't think I've ever been. Well, I suppose when I was a teenager, yes, I was. I, I was conscious of fashion. Um, but then the fashion was not like it is now. I mean, I'm 72, so um, I don't, you know, I wear what's comfortable. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay, I've got skinny jeans on because I, I used to, I had skinny jeans when they first came out years and years ago. <laughs> and I, I, I used to ride. Um, I, oh, I, um, I had a, a pony, you know, like when I was nine, and I rode, I rode for the Beaufort, so. I I used to tight trousers like job, jobbers and things like that. So mm. that to mm. me they're comfortable. Mm. Yeah, well, <laughs> they're, they're stretchy, so yeah. they're comfortable. Yeah. And I hate rigid rigid jeans. Yeah. So, oh wow. But uh, no. All right, thank you. That anyway, nice good luck. You. I'm, I'm Seb, by the way. Oh, I'm Julia. Yeah. Oh. Oh. <laughs> yeah. So <laughs> you're my friend, aren't you? You've got a lot to say for yourself. Oh, really? <laughs> But he's a good, he's a good working dog. He yeah. really is. He's very right. Nice to meet you. Yeah. Have a, have a good day as well. And you. Come on. Bye. We'll come. <laughs>